This is the avian flu bill, and uh, there were three sections. The section one was taken out. The House adopted uh, or agreed to sections two and three of the Senate version. On the motion to adopt the conference committee report, all those in favor? Senator Ingebrigtsen, on Senator, the motion. Would Senator Dahl yield for a question, please? Senator Dahl will yield. Senator Ingebrigtsen. Se Senator Dahl, <laughs> thank you for yielding. Section one, would you go over that for, for the, the body, please? Which, which portion of that? And we had a long discussion about this bill, but I'm just getting the information on my desk now. Could you explain what section one is that's being deleted? Senator Dahl. Madam, Madam President and uh, Senator Ingebrigtsen, and that was just a report date on um, the reserves for the M M uh, for MMB. Senator Westrom. Madam President, uh, members, I would urge uh, the adoption of this uh, conference report. Um, we could have had this done a week ago if uh, my uh, amendment uh, would have prevailed to uh, take this out in the first place, but I'm glad uh, the Senate is uh, going to move along now. So uh, uh, I guess it's one of those things you told, I told you so, but we'll see, uh, uh, see how it, the vote goes. But members, we have uh, turkey farmers continuing to uh, suffer from this avian flu, uh, now over 3 million birds affected in our state. And so uh, I don't think we've heard the end of it yet. Uh, but let's expedite this and get it to the governor's desk. Senator Dahl. Thank you, Madam President. Thank you, uh, Senator Westrom. There were numerous uh, small additions made. I think the conference committee was a good committee. I thank Senator Dames for his input on that, and Senator Scoy, of course. And uh, it was a good discussion. There was a, a few minor additions made to the language that uh, we had this last week that were related to uh, accessing the federal funds. And I think it's a better bill that went out because of the conference committee. Uh, just to let people know uh, that uh, we will have to address this issue con uh, before we're done. Again, the, the amount appropriated is not enough at this time, but uh, we do have some plans to to uh, access more federal funds, but also perhaps get some more state money. I thank you, Conference Committee, for your work. Senator Dames. Well, thank you, Madam Chair, uh, Madam President, and members. I would, too, encourage folks to support this and move this uh, uh, bill out of here with a green vote. I'd like to thank Senator Dahl and Senator Scoy for their work on this and agreeing to this amendment, or to agreeing to the conference committee uh, as it came out, this uh, bill came out. So, and as Senator Dahl alluded to, uh, this uh, uh, is a good start. We will be looking at some more funding. I think there's an estimate that we'll need about another 7.3 million to handle this issue until about the middle of June of 2016. So with that said, uh, I would appreciate if people would vote for this bill so we can get this signed by the governor and get this moving forward. On the motion to adopt the conference committee report, all those in favor say aye. aye. Opposed, nay. Motion prevails. Secretary will give House File 2225 its third reading. House File number 2225, a bill for an act relating to agriculture, appropriating money for avian influenza emergency response activities. Is there any more discussion? Secretary will take the roll. All members having voted that desire to vote, the secretary will close the roll. There being 64 ayes and zero nays, the bill is passed and its title agreed to.